Good evening guys, this is Sumaya. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today in this video we are going to learn how to fix recess lights showing as surface in Dialogs Evo. In your project, when you get IES files for the recess luminous and you import in the Dialogs Evo, your IES files may appear like this which looks like a surface mount lighting. To make it look as recessed, you might go to the side elevation and move it up to make it look recessed like this. But this is a time consuming step and if you're working on larger projects, repeating these steps every time is frustrating. So here is a simple solution. We will import the IES files, go to the lights, open luminaire list, import luminaire. You can choose the IES files you need. Here, no changes. Next, here is a thing which you need to focus. In housing and light output, no need to make any changes in the length and width. Height of the IES files, now it is 0.1. Usually for all the IES files, irrespective of whether it's a downlight linear profile or, a, or track module, the height will be 0.1. If you want this as a recessed IES files, what you can do is reduce its height to 0.001. That is 0.001 meters and finish. Now go to the plan view and let's make a rectangular arrangement. Now check, see, now your IS files is recessed. Even if you place individual luminaire, it's, it's recessed. No need of going to the site of the elevations and adjusting its position. This is the simple solution. You can follow the same steps for linear profile lights. Let's check for linear profile IES file considering colors from intra lighting and here is the IES file I will select download okay my IES file is downloaded let's import it open luminaire import IES files this is the IES file next see here height of the housing again it's 0.1 meters 0.1 meters so we will make it 0.001 meters finish now place luminaire see here it's it's a recessed fixture so this way you can edit the IES files to make it look as a recessed fixture this step can be possible only for the IES files not the LDT files if you are using the LDT files you have to use the LDT editor to change the height of it we will see that in the upcoming tutorials of editing the LDT files so this is it guys in this video if you found this video helpful please do hit a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and stay tuned to explore more in dialogues with me Thank you.